Today, we'll focus on the fact that this is a 4th of July weekend. So let's pray together. Everlasting God of grace and goodness, this weekend, as we do celebrate Independence Day, remind us of our complete dependence upon you. We live in a country with so much freedom, but in Christ, we also enjoy a deeper spiritual freedom. And we look to you for your wisdom and mercy as we live the life that you gave to each of us. So what a blessing it is to enjoy the the many freedoms we have in this country. And so I I pray that we do not take any of it for granted, that we may live thankful lives each and every day, even in the midst of all the turmoil that is taking place. And we're thankful for those whose lives uh, and their work provide for our freedom, those in the military, the police, and also medical workers, and all those whose service protects us and allows us to live freely. And we pray that you would grant our nation's leaders wisdom, that there will be times of peace and justice in our country and in our world. And on this day, we ask that you keep our nation and all nations under your care, that we may be people who are at peace and who are a blessing to others. And we are thankful for our freedoms, but as we are thankful, we also remember those who don't enjoy the same freedoms that we might experience and feel, that they are held captive because of the color of their skin, their education, their religion, or the amount of money that they have. And we also pray for people in other countries who are not free due to war or oppression or discrimination or injustice that divides and dominates. And even as we enjoy so many blessings here, we cry out to you, O God, for those who suffer. And we pray for ourselves and help us in our individual needs and the pain that we might feel this day. Lord, help remove from us anything that would take away our freedom or the freedom of our spirit or our hearts because we can be held captive by our attitudes, our addictions, our brokenness, our prejudice, our selfishness, our inability to forgive, our inability to love. And on this day, keep all of us grounded, not in our own strength, but in yours, relying on the promise that those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will not uh, walk and not be faint. So God, give us the ability, the strength, the love, the courage, the freedom to live life as you intended. And we all pray this in the name of Christ. Amen.